Hey guys, today we got a special job. Today we got a uh, Xbox One X uh, that does not have any video. We're going to be replacing the Wii timer chip on this particular Xbox and I'm going to be showing you how to do it. This works for me and it's um, fairly simple and we can get it done in uh, just a few minutes. So I'm going to get everything set up. We're going to get the uh, the heat gun here real quick and the um, the soldering iron here preheated and everything. What you see here is the Xbox already taken apart uh, and the motherboard on here. So just bear with me. We're going to get started here shortly. I'm just adjusting the uh, heat temperature and the uh, I've already added flux as you can see by the way. Not too much, just enough so that we can get the job done. By the way, if you guys need help or this service, uh, an Xbox like this, this happens to Xbox One S's and X's as well. So if you guys need this service done, you can always contact us for help or you can also have us uh, do the service for you at wayaeo.org. That's wayaeo.org. We're just getting it hot enough so that we can lift it, remove the chip, and then replace it right away with the new one that I just showed. You can see the pins, the solder getting uh, shiny. That means it's, it's uh, at its melting point. Easily remove and replace with the new one. Now we just got to get it in place and I like it to be perfect. So this looks perfect to me. Now I do use um, solder paste, uh, mechanic solder paste. We're going to be applying a little dab on each side of the chip itself. And that way we can just, just use this particular uh, solder to, to touch the, the pads on the sides, make sure they're making good contact, as you see here. This particular paste has flux in there already, so it works very well. That looks pretty good. That is good. It's perfect. Now I do like to give it one last check, uh, clean it up a little bit with a little bit of 99% uh, alcohol. It's also known as IPA. And then check the sides, make sure they're good. Again, if you guys need service, uh, this service done, just uh, visit our website. Or if you guys need help, we'll gladly help you out. You can post in the comments. I'll be leaving a description of the things that I used here on the, uh, 
on the notes there on the uh, YouTube uh, description part. Uh, if you guys have any questions, just feel free to contact me at yaeo.org, W-A-Y-A-Y-E-O.org. So I'm just giving it a little cleaning. So now we're just inspecting the uh, sides and make sure that it is uh, it's soldered properly. Hopefully you guys can see well on the camera. Um, on the next video, so we're going to be using uh, another camera so that you guys can see the disassembling process as well as the testing process. Uh, but I haven't had any of these uh, systems where I, we replace a chip and it doesn't work. 99% of the time this is the issue with this particular Xboxes. Of course, you have to check the filters first and uh, make sure that the HDMI port itself is well. It, it, it's seated, seated properly and it's in good condition. So it looks perfect. I'm going to give it one, one last cleaning. And this is pretty much it, guys. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and assemble this and test it out. I am confident that it's going to work. And um, if you guys have any questions, if I can be of any service, feel free to contact me. Thank you for watching and uh, continue to uh, check our uh, channel for uh, more uploads in the future. And subscribe. Thank you very much. Have a good day now.